for all looking for some cheap Falls Rise and Fall credits, then check out 5mmo.com. I'll leave a link down below to their site in the description. You can get 10 million credits for less than 10 pounds. Use discount code Hyrax at checkout for 5% off. Yo guys, welcome back to another video. I'm in this 2015 Range Rover Sport SVR. The main reason for today's video is the off-road body kit for this thing. Now, a new feature for Forza Horizon 4 is that quite a few off-road cars have got body kits now. But oh my god! I don't know how, but I've just not got an off-road car with a body kit on this game yet, I don't think. Like, almost a month. I've had this game like a month, right? And I've not got an off-road car with a body kit. Madness! I know, but today that's changing because we're gonna... Do an off-road build on this Range Rover. It's already like an off-road car, isn't it? Let's be honest, So The off-road body kit on this must look mad. So that's what we're doing today, guys. So, upgrade to tune in. Here we go. Body kit presets. Let's have a look. What it looks like around about now. Oh, mad. It's just a bit mad, isn't it? Just look at the difference. Oh, it just lifted, like, lifting a Range Rover even more. It's a bit mad. Adds a light bar on it as well, doesn't it? And the massive fenders and the bull bar at the front as well. Is that everything it adds? Am I missing something? Anything at the back? No. Uh, we're going to stick that on. Buy for 17500 I thought it would have been more expensive than that. I'm also going to pick a better design. This design, it wasn't made by me. It was one I got off a storefront, but don't really like it now. I'm going to go and find a better one. I think we're going to go with this orange one because orange is my favourite colour. I think it's going to look pretty good. On this Ranger, you know, it's lifted Range Rover. I, I hope it does look good. Yeah, it's a great game. Yes, here we go. In the Rangey. Land Rover G4 Challenge. I've not done any mechanical upgrades to it. Still A class. I felt the car is quick enough like this, so I've left everything. It looks like it's got massive wheels on it, but it's just a fender sticking out. It's quite cool. I like it. The light bar is on. It's looking a bit crazy. What should we do with this thing? I don't know. I think maybe we'll do an online race. That sounds a bit fun. Because our beast of a Range Rover will be able to win everything. Might not. But I hope it does pretty much. So yeah, let's go and find some online racing. Several months later. Okay, so it looks like we're not going online racing because it was quite hard to find a lobby. And when I did, it was only ever like S2 class and this Range Rover is A class. So I wish you could pick what class lobbies you want to go into. But yeah, it's just I'm going to be here ages pretty much trying to find an A class one with enough players in. So anyway, let's go um, mountain climbing in this Range Rover and see how well it is for A class. You know, let's find some high points on this map. Let's see if we can get up there easily in this Range Rover. It looks very high, but I don't know if it'll be difficult. It looks it, but let's go and give it a go. I think this Range Rover will be pretty good at handling it, really, because it is A-class. And, yeah, this side seems the steepest from about here, going upwards. It looked massive in drone mode, this hill, but it's just not, is it? That's a bit of a shame, really. And the Range Rover is just bouncing up at 60 mile an hour. Um, we're here. Oh no, it goes higher. It goes higher. Don't worry. I've never been up this bit before. So it's like pathways and that. This is... Yeah, it just keeps going higher. This is quite interesting actually. Can we get up that bit here? Oh, there's a fast travel board. Just smash it right at the top of here. Yeah, I think we can get up there. Let's go for it, guys. I've only ever been up one tall bit in the snow and it just looks completely different now and they're rocks. Lifted Range Rover. Not lifted enough to drive over them. Bit of rock crawling, can it? Go over these. No, it, it can't. Not lifted enough. Okay. Lifted Range Rover, go on! Nope. Oh yeah, lifted Range Rover. There you go, there you go. Off-road. Whip. Absolute off-road sensation. Let's go up this bit. Again, they look really tall and hard to get up from far away, but they're just not these mountains, are they? Um, yeah, it's definitely one of the tallest peaks of the map. Go up here. Make it a little bit more dear. Oh, no. Oh, no. Oh, no. Where am I going? Please, no. I've, I've got it stuck. Prob no. No. I, this, <laughs> I fell off, but don't worry. The respawn on point. Kind of wish it wasn't, though. Been more interesting. Come on. Range Rover can do it. Hopefully in an expansion we get a lot more hills like this. Be off and go up. Uh, oh, another fast travel board. 
I need them. Got that one. 11 out of 50, is that it? That bit's higher than this bit, isn't it? Yep. Sure is. Then can we get to the top of them rocks? That is the question. The question. Don't actually know. Oh yes, yes, I found an opening. Found an opening. Like so, little Range Rover coping very, very well for these with these hills actually. And then that is the. This is it. The tallest part of the map. You can see a lot of things from here. You can actually see the whole map. But there's like the um, the windmills and that. Whatever the like wind turbines on the moors. Uh, there's a lake. The big lake. It's a shame we can't go up all these mountains on the edge. That'd be so fun, honestly. Oh, look, there's some bridges over there. Oh, this bit. This bit is just as high. We'll get a good viewing point from over here, definitely. It's a bomb find. And, oh, almost fell off. Almost, almost fell off. Yeah, it's just the bottom of the map there. And there is the train track for the Royal Scotsman. But yeah, guys, we've made it to the highest point in the map in summer as well. I've only been here in winter, so it looks completely different. Now, thank you very much for watching. This was uh, an off-road body kit build on the Range Rover. Let, let's get this video to like 30 or 40 likes. That'd be amazing. Subscribe if you're on around here. But I hope you enjoyed. But until next time, guys, peace out. But I already know I'ma get it now, though. I'ma get it now, though. I'm not slowing down, though. Coming for that crown.